my channel if you're new here my name is Jay welcome back to another lock up date okay so y'all it has been a whole year with the micro locks y'all I really can't even believe I made it a whole year with something like I, your girl need a pat on the back okay she needs a pat on the back at this point because girl we doing something y'all I started this lock journey on 2 222 and I have not looked back since. We love it here, okay? We absolutely love it here. Obviously, a few things have changed since my six month lock up date, but girl, girl, <laughs> they've changed for the better. Cause I mean, I mean, <clears throat> what? <laughs> they were not doing this at six months, y'all. It was a little bit stiff because they were just a little bit dry. And also they just didn't really have a whole lot of weight on them they hadn't like locked enough to had a little movement on them or anything like that so i'm really 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 excited about this year like this year went by so fast and i feel like it went by fast because i wasn't sitting back like watching my hair watching it grow trying to figure out oh my gosh what my hair gonna look like next i can't wait till my hair get a certain length so it can look like this or it can look like that girl this was peaceful to say the least if you follow my traditional lock journey y'all y'all know it, it was like it was a challenge like it was very much something that i was very much not up for okay i was not expecting everything to happen so fast everything just like boom 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 like i went from having link to no link it was crazy my edges were always looking crazy and i just uh, <laughs> it was a lot of things like I felt about that set of locks that I didn't have those same issues or feelings or problems with, with this set of locks. Y'all, the micro locks, they, they doing their thing, okay? They doing their thing. They grow so fast. Like, you'll look up one day <laughs> and you'll have like length. It, it's crazy, y'all. Like, mind blowing, no lie. Since I did have both the traditional locks and the micro locks, I do compare the two a lot. And I think it's normal because I've been through both journeys. Like, I've been through journey after journey after journey. It was natural hair, it was traditional locks, it's micro locks. These here to stay for a little while. I don't know how long, but they here to stay for a little while. I'm like not in a rush to do anything to these. I really love it here. Like, I, it's been a minute since I could just be like, I love my hair. The only thing for me is the maintenance. Y'all, the maintenance. It doesn't matter what way you wear your hair, you're going to have to maintain it. But um, the micro lock maintenance for me has been a little bit more, how do I say it? Like, um, it's been a lot. It, it has been a lot. Only because um, I'm not one of those people that can go for six weeks or eight weeks or whatever without doing a retie. I have to have my reties on schedule every four weeks. If I don't get a retie by four weeks, like my edges, like they literally hurt to move them, pull them up and just different things. And the middle seems like it grows so fast. If I go past four weeks, I'm retying for, well, I'm retiring for hours and hours anyway, but it's like an even longer period of time. So, um, I think it was at my six month mark when I was telling you guys like I had gone for so long without retying my hair. I had like this much new growth in the middle. It had been like maybe three months or four months or something like that without retying the middle of my hair. Cause what I'll do is like retie the front part just so that part looks fresh. I can put it up in a ponytail and um, or I can like wear it like a headband on it, whatever. I just can make it look good because at least the front is fresh. I had gone for so long though without retie in the middle of my head it was it was a lot it was a lot it took me days and days and days to do a retie i don't like that okay i do not like that so yeah every set does definitely have its pros and cons like a retwist for me would take like two hours with traditional locks as for a retie takes me two days you do with that info what you would like but it's also different for everybody i just work really slow i feel like i everything i do is slow. <laughs> when i did braids 
slow like i can do so much i just work slow when i do my kids hair it's slow the two days are of course broken up though it's like six hours maybe this day and then six hours maybe the next day the middle part to me takes the absolute longest it's like the way my greed is or the way my parting is i have the most in the back or in the middle and it also seems like my hair grows the fastest like in that middle section so it's like i have more new growth or whatever to retie and it just takes a lot longer it's also something that i cannot see while i'm doing for the most part some of them i can like the ones on the sides and stuff like that and if i hold it up and retie then i can see but I can't really see it. Another big difference for me from six months to a year is the length. Like I'm finally starting to see like a little drop girl. Like what? Stop playing with me. Stop playing with her. She is not one of them. Okay, stop. <laughs> Honestly though, I definitely have a lot more length than what I had at the six month mark. So at my six month mark, I feel like my hair was maybe like right here. Maybe I cannot. I don't remember exactly where it was, but I thought it was kind of long then and it really had shrunk up a good bit and I just really didn't realize it. And even in that six month lock up date video, I had stretched my hair like I had braided it the night before to make sure it was stretched today. I ain't do none of that. Like we here. <laughs> it is still definitely a difference though. Like if I freshly wash my hair, it will be shrunken up still. It is still about right here. Something like that. Give or take. It looks like kind of like a mini little afro but not really an afro you know what's going on now but i was so ready to see length y'all i am so happy to be here it wasn't bad at six months or in the months between or whatever when it did the little shrinking thing because i had shrinkage but i also had volume you know with my traditional locks i just had shrinkage no volume it's flat to my head i look like somebody's grandma that's what it was giving me it was giving grandma very much giving grandma I didn't like it. Now I do feel like I have a little bit less volume than I did in those like in between stages. My hair kind of resembles what it looked like to me when I came up here the very first time like when I started these micro locks. When I started them um my hair kind of looked like this. It wasn't as full but it, it kind of like the volume looked the same it looks similar i'm gonna pop a picture up here if i can remember to do so but yeah the volume just really looks the same to me like it's like around that it's starting to kind of like flatten out not flatten i don't want to call it flat because it's not flat it still is voluminous and i love that about these but it's starting to get like a little bit more weighed down than what it was because at first it was just afros loose hair although my hair is not fully locked it's definitely starting to do a lot better like trying to find one to show you guys like this it has locked so much down the shaft now like it's locked from here to like right here so the ends are still loose it's just because they haven't fully locked yet just like with my last set of locks though the ones in the back they lock in especially the ones on the back row fully locked for the most part it's like this much curly in on the end and um, I don't know if that'll ever lock. It It may, it may not. I don't know. My hair is like a completely different texture in the back. So we'll see what it does. I'm not going to comb it out. I'm not going to make sure they stay curly. I'm not doing any of that. I, I just feel like locks are supposed to be really carefree. And I just really don't want to go through that. I, no, I'm okay. Even though it's like starting to drop a little bit and like flatten out. I'm still okay with where the volume is. It's like. This is good. <laughs> so I know I kind of showed you guys the length or whatever, but I'm going to spin around and let you guys see what my hair is looking like now. I probably need another chair. Hold on. We up close and personal now. <laughs> but I'm used to doing this in my spinning chair, so here we are. I'm going to let you guys go ahead and see what it's looking like. Um, I know a lot of you guys come here for that part because I used to watch people's lock updates and I only really want to see what their hair was looking like at each stage. So I'm also going to make sure I make a video on what each month looked like for me. But yeah, let's go ahead and get into this. Are you going? that you're gonna be tell you what i did last night i came home say around a quarter to three still so high hypnotized in a trance from this body soap butter red brown and 
tantalizing You were the thought I needed help From this feeling that I felt So shook I had to catch my breath So yeah y'all, this is one year micro lock and I think that's all I have. So yeah, if you have any questions or anything like that, be sure to drop them down below in the comment section. Um, be sure to hit that red subscribe button, you guys, because the lock content is coming. I saw the analytics. I know what you guys want to see. <laughs> you guys came here for the locks. And we're here, okay? <laughs> so I'm going to make sure I give you guys more of that. So yeah, any comments, any video suggestions, anything like that, um, be sure to drop them down below in the comment section. Be sure to hit that red subscribe button and I will see you guys in my next one. Ooh.